My age family, I want to come to you guys real quick from that video from Peyton. Uh, being a leader, uh, my dad taught me a lot about this when I was 24 years old, that I needed like 10 years of hard work to, to earn respect to the people in the kitchen and be that leader because I was really young. He had their respect. Just like MIH Mastermind, um, people ask me sometimes, why do you do so much? You have so many deals and, I, and, I, and a lot of passive and I could be relaxing a little more. And I explained to him, I made a choice and a commitment to do this mastermind. And then when you take people's money, lower the, whether it's a thousand dollars or 40,000, it doesn't matter. You're committing to being a leader for that person. And to be that leader, there's people come in the space, do a couple deals and uh, they're teaching and they think they know everything. They haven't even gone full cycle. They have two years experience talking over people. I know a lot of people like that, but I made a commitment to earn the trust of the people in my age. I show that I've done the education from 2015 to 25 years, three hours a day, I'm still educating. I show that I started at 23 years old. I show that um, I, I can be that leader. I have to show that. I also have to show, like at the restaurant, like he says, I have to be the first one to show up and the last one to stop. It's just the way it is. It's, if, if it's gonna be, if I don't wanna do that, I have to stop the mastermind. But I made a commitment because I love this family. Everybody's at my house this weekend, uh, a couple weekends ago, um, to about 20 people from my age. And now we're going to Houston. It's a, I want to keep this going. We started 365 David Goggins chat. Uh, people are and Andy's down weight. Everybody's getting you know healthy, working on the health together, building relationships stronger. That chat's changing lives on the health side, which lead to the wealth side. So it's just like Peyton says, you you to be a leader. It's just like being an entrepreneur. It's not for everybody. Um, if you're going to be a leader, it's a lifelong commitment. As long as you want to lead the people and whatever group you're in, if it's at a restaurant, if you're running a business, if you're doing something, it's a commitment, a serious one that you got to make. Like my family right now, they're at the pool. I'm going to get my five, where I'm away on vacation, I'm going to get my five uh, mile walk slash jog slash whatever uh, in. And it's going to be one hour less of me being at the pool with them because I have a commitment to my health. And I'm showing them, my wife and my kids are happy that I'm taking care of myself because they want dad to be in good shape and stay in good shape. Because like me and Robert, as you know, we're chefs and we like to eat really good. So it's guys, I'm just telling you, uh, if you're gonna be a leader, it's not like a six month commitment. If you're gonna be a coach, if you're gonna try and teach people, you gotta really go all in. You gotta really be dedicated. You gotta earn their trust, their respect. I'd say about 30 years old, I earned serious respect in my restaurant. When I was like 23 to 30, my father was there and he had the respect, he was older, he really knew, I was learning. You know, they, they respected me, but there was older people that were more experienced than me. And they respected me because I was the owner and, and uh, my dad. But as I learned, and I did great things in the restaurant, won an award and this and that, and even also just did amazing caterings, amazing food, I became a great chef. I earned the respect from everybody. Um, and nothing's given. It needs to be earned. Sometimes people never earn it just because they just can't be a leader. They just, they don't learn. They're lazy. They don't want to put the work in. And the people work for you. They're just not going to respect you. They're just going to realize, hey, this, our leader is lazy and he's not good at what he does. He's just pointing fingers. You know, there's that thing, the leader and a boss, my father always used to teach me. So guys, I hope this helps. And I hope you see how Hadar, Hadar too, Hadar shows up every day. Even when me just made slides for Houston. I sent them the presentation. We made slides. So he made the slides. We went over it. We're going to go there. And I will always, I love putting the work in. I live off of this. I love my family. I love going away. I have found my balance. And I love being a leader. And I've, the lives we've, I've changed already is unbelievable. Uh, the the my house, the, the, the 20 people that were there, everybody doing deals together, everybody giving hugs. I mean, how close the people are. It's not even about the deals. It's about the friendships I'm helping to create because because that's happiness. The relationship is happiness. <coughs> and then anybody can make money. Anybody could go buy a duplex, a fourplex, a 10 unit, a 100. We all could do that. We all could buy some crypto together. We all could flip a house together. It's the true relationships, not just hey, I got a JV deal, and then like seven random people are partnering, and they can't stand each other. Like, I'm not going to say that other group. They had 14 people in the deal. Nobody knows each other. We're not doing that. We're creating real fucking relationships, real ones. Like Vineet, Vineet, Dr. Gupta's nephew, he's in he's in uh, a 40-unit JV with me. He's in other deals. Christina Kovacs and Debbie uh, Wilcox and Darren Light and, and Hadar and Chris Jackson, 
All my partners are amazing. I have like amazing relationships with them. Robert Musso, Jai Deep. So that's as your leader, I want to stress that. I want to stress the law of attraction. I want to stress the, the proper lessons in life. Not just, hey, get a deal, partner with just anybody. No, come into MIH like Erica's in and she's new. Build relationships. You got Lindsay, Lauren she met that she loves. Build these relationships. And progress is happiness. Keep progressing forward. Don't worry about how many deals I have or whatever. And just keep making these amazing relationships because you have your family, you have your friends, and now you have your new family in MIH, which is going to make your life amazing. Proud to be your leader. I will always do my best, and I take constructive criticism great uh, from since I'm 21 years old till now. I'm still getting better. I think by 60 or 70, I'll, I'll be really, really, really good. I think I'm good now, but can always improve on how I talk to people, on how I learn, on what I do, and I will. And we'll hopefully I live to 70 or 80 because I'm looking forward to being a leader for a long time. Have a great day.